We have ignition, full thrust. Two good SRBs, everything looking good. And the vehicle's cleared the tower. Pitch and roll programs are in, right as expected. Seeing expected body rates. Engine can easily look good, SRB's looking good. Next mark event we're looking for is our first throttle segment on the RD-180. And we are throttling down per plan on the RD-180. Everything looking good. And body rates have, small, have a roll, smoothed out. Everything looking good there. And passing through max Q. We have now through the maximum uh, region of maximum dy dynamic pressure. Coming up on Mach 1. Mach 1, Mach 1. Butch and Sunny are now supersonic. And engines throttling up for the nominal sequence. Everything looking good. Next event we're looking for is SRB burnout. SRB is rolling off, and we have SRB burnout. Normal shutdown signature, 50 seconds to SRB jet, and we've throttled up to full power. Everything looking good. Vehicle is now 15 miles in altitude, 8 miles downrange, traveling at 2,087 miles per hour. And we're flying right down the center of the range track, nominal trajectory. Engine continues to look good. And the vehicle now weighs half its mass uh, from liftoff. Engine burning normally. Coming up on SRB jettison. And we have jettison. Both SRBs have jettisoned. RD-180 continues to burn normally. And we've enabled closed loop steering. Body rate disturbances look good. Vehicle hydraulics look good right down the middle. And we are now 31 miles in altitude, 43 miles downrange, traveling at 4,200 miles per hour. And we've throttled down uh, the engine per its nominal sequence. Everything looking good. Body rates look good. And we've fired the power valve, pressurizing the reaction control system on the second stage. Everything looking good. Okay, main engine burning right as expected. Everything looks good. Smooth body rates. Continuing to accelerate smoothly, a little over 3 Gs. You know, one minute to nominal BECO. And we've begun our constant 3.5 G acceleration phase. The engine is now throttling to maintain a steady 3.5 Gs on the vehicle. You're seeing the acceleration rate go down. And continuing to throttle down to maintain that 3.5 Gs. Everything looking good. And we start a boost phase chill down. Everything looking good. Coming up on booster engine cutoff. And we've completed boost phase chill down. Everything looks good. And BECO, main engine cutoff, coming up on staging. We have stage separation. Everything looks good there. We have pre-start unlocks and fuel. Ignition. Full thrust. Two good main engines on Centaur. Everything looking good. And we've enabled steering. 
now that we're in second stage operation. Everything looks good there. Coming up on Aeroskirt Jettison, we've had Aeroskirt Jettison. Everything looks good there. Both engines continue to burn normally. And this is nominally a seven minute, 10 second burn. And we've seen PU go to open loop, making locks correction as expected. Cut off. We have Starliner separation right on time. Everything looking good. Butch and Sunny are now flying free of Centaur.